Hi, Jim from Droneland Australia here. In a previous video, we ran through some of the specs of the Mavic 3 multi-spectral drone, but today I wanted to show you the live Indy VI view that you can get from the controller while flying the drone. So let's uh, get in the air. All right, so now that I've got the drone in the air, I'm gonna fly up to about 120 meters so I can get a good view of the paddock that I'm interested in. Gimbal down, and then switch over to the multi-spectral view. Shows me where there's stress vegetation or where there's healthy vegetation. Healthy vegetation would be identified in red and stress vegetation, orange, and down to yellow. So this is a really good way for me to fly over a paddock and get a good sense of what's going on in the paddock, where some of the plants might be stressed. That way I can go back and manage those issues. And I can do all of this without processing any data on a computer. To the side-by-side -side view so that I can see my multi-spectral image and my RGB image at the same time. So in this paddock, I can see that a lot of the trees are bright green, have a lot of chlorophyll in them, look very healthy. Some of the grass in the paddock looks pretty good. There are other areas in the paddock that might need more water, more nutrients, so I can use this information to manage an operation or a paddock. When I'm ready to bring the drone home, I can then just hit return to home and it'll automatically come return back to where home. it landed. So that's the live view of the DJI Mavic 3 Multispectral in Indy VI. For more information, visit our website at droneland.au or check us out on our socials.